How many times did you have to deal with your mask fogging up while scuba diving or snorkeling? Today we are going to talk about 5 plus 1 things to do to prevent your mask from fogging up. And if you stay until the end of this video, I am also going to share with you one thing you must do with a brand new mask or after a long period of inactivity like this quarantine time. Let's dive into it! Hey there! Welcome back to my channel and before starting remember that each one of these techniques must be done with a perfectly dry mask, if not it might not work. Number 1. Commercial defogging agents. Commercial defogging agents are specifically designed to coat a mask lens and many divers find these products more effective than other methods, but not everyone. Put a few drops of the fogging agent in the mask and rinse briefly with water. It's better if it is the same water where you are going to dive in. Remember, the idea is to leave a thin layer of the fogging agent inside the mask. Number 2. Saliva. If you are not a diver yet, I know it can sound a bit weird but saliva is the most common and natural defogging agent on the planet. You have just to spit on the lens inside the mask and rub it around with your finger. Then dunk the mask in a bucket of the same water where you are going to dive in and leave it there until you are ready to jump in and dive. Or just wash it once you are in the water. Number 3. Shampoo or baby shampoo. You can use shampoo or baby shampoo just like a commercial defogging solution. Many divers carry a bottle of watered down baby shampoo or shampoo with their dive gear. Few drops rubbed into the lens and then briefly rinsed out keep a mask from fogging up. Baby shampoo is preferable to standard shampoo as it is generally hypoallergenic, less irritating to your eyes, biodegradable it smells good too. Number 4. Glycerin soaps and dishwashing detergents. Glycerin soaps and dishwashing detergents can be used in the same way as baby shampoo. Just put a few drops inside the mask, wrap them in and rinse briefly. The problem with these products is that they can burn the eyes and most of the time they are not biodegradable. Except for mine that it is biodegradable. Be sure not to dump any non-biodegradable defogging agents into the water. Ok, let's go to the number 5. Toothpaste. Rub a non-abrasive toothpaste inside the mask lens until it coats the glass completely. Rinse the mask gently with water until the lens is clear. Remember that if you are highly sensitive to minty fragrances like most of the toothpaste, the air inside the mask may burn your eyes or your cheeks during the dive. Before diving for the first time using toothpaste as a defogging agent, wear the mask a few minutes before the dive to make sure that the fragrance is not irritating. Or just use a simple toothpaste without strong fragrances. If you appreciate this video, don't forget to smash that like button and if you want to see more, remember to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Potatoes A cut potato rubbed inside the mask lens has been said to keep it from fogging up. Rub the potato on the glass, rinse briefly and dive. I haven't put this method on the main tips list because I never tried it and also because it's kind of a diving urban legend. But feel free to try it the next time you have a potato and a knife handy before the dive. And if you already tested it, let me know if it works in the comments. At the beginning of this video I told you that I was going to share with you guys the number one thing to do 
if you have just bought a brand new mask or if it is a long period of not using it like this quarantine time. You have to know that when a mask is new or is not used for a long period of time, the soft part of the mask releases a lot of tiny silicon particles which forms a really thin layer of silicon on the lenses that 9 out of 10 times, no matter how much saliva or other defogging agents you use, you are going to dive with a foggy mask. So, what can you do to solve this problem? Simple. Burn your mask. Yes, I said burn your mask, but don't get me wrong. You don't have actually to burn it. Just run the tip of a flame over the inside of the lens until the glass turns black. The flame burns the silicone residue off. A lighter of a candle works well for this trick but don't use windproof lighter, the one like tiny blowtorch. It can damage the lens of your mask really bad. Once the inside of the mask lens is completely black, wait for the mask to cool down and put a few drops of dishwashing soap. Dunk the mask in fresh water and leave it there for at least 10 minutes. Then wash it carefully and dry the mask with a soft cloth. For a perfect result, repeat this process two or three times until it is difficult to get the glass to turn black. Do not allow the glass to get extremely hot and do not attempt these tricks on masks with plastic lenses. They will melt. Be sure to keep the flame away from the soft silicone skirt of the mask as it will melt easily. Okay, now you know everything you can do to prevent your mask from fogging up. Let me know in the comment below if you already knew some of those tricks and see you next time. Peace.